Our first example is 13 square. Here 13 is near to which base? That is 10. So for 10 how much extra we are having here? 3. So our sum is 13. Our excess value is 3. So 13 plus 3 how much? 16. So 16 is our first part answer. Or what is our excess value? 3. So square of this number 3 square means how much? 9. So that is the second part answer. So, 13 square answer is 169. So, once again I am explaining this. 13 square means a given number is 13. So, for 10 how much extra we are having? 10 plus 3? 13. So, 3 is the excess value. So, we have written excess value and added. 13 plus 3 is 16. So, first part answer is 16. Now, that excess value we have to square. So, 3 square means how much? 9. So, that is the second part answer. So, 13 square means 169. Let us see the next example, 18 square. For 10, how much extra we are having here? 8. So, 18 plus 8, how much it is? 26. So, write down 26 is the first part answer. Now, what is our excess value? 8. So, square of this number, 8 square means how much? 64. So, write down 4 and 6 below. Now, add 26 plus 6 is 32 and write down this 4. So, 18 square answer is 324. Now, let us see 91 square. Here, 91 is nearer to 100. That is below 100. So, 100 minus 91, how much it is? 9. So, what we have to do for 91? You subtract the deficient value 9. 91 minus 9. How much we will get now? 82. So, 82 is the first part answer. Now, what we have to do? Second part. Square of this number. 9 square means how much it is? 9 square means 81. So, write down the 81. So, 91 square answer is 8281. Now see the next example, 88 square. So 100 minus 88, how much it is? 12. So our deficient value is 12. What we have to do now? Subtract from 88. 88 minus 12, you will get 76. So 76 is the first part answer. Now what is our deficient value? 12. So 12 square we have to write. 12 square means how much? 144. What we have to do? Write on 44. Here only 2 digit allowed. That extra 1 we will write as a carry. Now answer is 7000. 6 plus 1 is 7. And write on 44. So our answer is 7744. See next example 1 of 3 square. Here 1 of 3 base value is 100. So, first what we have to do, for 100, how much excess value is there here? 3. So, for given question, 103, you add the excess value 3. 103 plus 3, how much we get the answer? 106. So, our first part answer is 106. Now, what is our excess value? 3. So, second part, what we have to do? Square of the excess value. 3 square means 9. Here, Base is 100. So, 2 digits are allowed. So, we write the answer here 09. So, 103 whole square is 10,609. Next example is 108 square. For 100, how much excess we are having here? 8. So, write on given question 108. Add the excess value. We get the answer 116. That is our first part answer. Now what we have to do? Square of the excess value. 80 square means 64. Here base is 100. 2 digits allowed. So write down 
8 square 64 value as it is. So 108 whole square answer is 11,664. Now see the next example 111 square. For 100 how much extra value we are having? 11. So for given question 111 you add the excess value. So we get the answer 122. This is our first part answer 122. Now what we have to do? Square of the excess value. 11 square means 121. So here base is 100. Only 2 digits are allowed. Write down 21 and 1 below. So our, our answer is 1, 2, 2 plus 1, 3. Remaining digits as it is. So 111 whole square means 12,321 is the answer. Now see the next example 997 whole square. So 997 is nearer to 1000. So our base value is 1000. So how much it is deficient for 1000? 1000 minus 997 is 3. So our given question is 997. So our deficient value is 3. So subtract this both we get the answer 994. So this is our first part answer 9994. Now what we have to do square of the deficient value. 3 square means how much? 9. What is our base here? 1000. 1000 base means 3 digits are allowed. So write on 0, 0, 3 square value 9. So this is our answer. See the next example, 988 square. How much it is below 1000? That means 1000 minus 988 means we get 12. So write the given question 988. Our deficient value is 12. Subtract both of them, we get the answer 976. So that is our first part answer. Now what we have to do? Square of the deficient value. 12 square means how much? 144. So write down the value. So this is our answer. See the example 1006 whole square. So here base number is 1000. For 1000 how much excess value we are having? That is 6. So first what we have to do? Take the given question 1006. Our excess value is 6. Add both of them 1006 plus 6. We get the answer 1012. So 1012 that is the first part answer. Now what is our excess value here? 6. So 6 square means how much? 36. 1000 base means we have to take 3 digit value. So write on here 0 and 6 square value 36. So this is our answer 10 lakh 12036. Now see the next example 9999 whole square. So this number is nearer to 10,000. So 10,000 is base number here. So 10,000 minus 9,999 we get 1 that is deficient value. So write on our given question 9,999 our deficient value is 1. So subtract both of them that is 9,998 that is first part answer. Now next what we have to do square of this value 1 square means 1. Here 1000 base 9999 means 10,000 base so 4 digits are allowed. So what we have to do place 3 zeros before and 1 square value 1. So this is our answer. See the next example 9989. So how much it is deficient to 10,000 subtract both. So from 10,000. 9,989 if we subtract, we get value 11, that is deficient value. Write down the given question, 9,989, deficient value is 11. Subtract both of them, so we get answer 9,978, that is our first part answer. Now what we have to do, 11 square, 11 square means 121. Here 10,000 base means 4 numbers are allowed. So place a 0 and write an 11 square value 121. So this is our answer. See the next example 10,006 whole square. So our base is here 10,000. How much excess value we are having here? 6. So for given number 10,006 add excess value 6. So our answer is 10,000. 
12. Our answer is 10,012. So that is first part answer. Now what we have to do? Square of the excess value. 6 square means 36. 10,000 means 4 digits are allowed. So place 2 zeros and add a square of this. 6 square means 36. So this is our answer. If you like this video, please like, share to your friends and subscribe. Thank you for watching.